Hello everyone, today I am going to demonstrate how you can use the goniometer to measure the range of cervical flexion and extension. So first, set the goniometer to 90 degrees and that will be our initial reading. Now, you will align the movable arm of the goniometer with the nostrils and the fixed arm of the goniometer is aligned perpendicular to the ground. And the axis of the goniometer is placed on the external auditory meters. After the placement of the goniometer, you will just ask the patient to perform the movement. So perform the movement. As you can see here, our patient has performed the movement. Now what we will do? We will just move the movable arm of the goniometer in the direction of the movement until it aligns perfectly with the nostrils again. And as you can see here, our final reading is 130 degrees. So if you will just subtract it, so the reading of the cervical flexion will be 40 degrees. And the normal reading of cervical flexion is 0 degrees to 45 degrees. So it should be considered as normal.